Hey guys, I wanted to make this video really quick to wish you all a happy um, Independence Day, 4th of July for those of you in the U.S. Um, and also a late um, Happy Canada Day for um, those who are of course in Canada. <laughs> I hope that this has been a great week for everybody. Um, I actually made a video changing all of them, all that you see here, into their outfits. But I had some issues with a couple things, and so I couldn't um, add that. So I'm instead making this video. They're already all changed, and you guys are getting actually a little bit of a sneak peek. You almost got two, um, like, spoiled surprises. But I wanted to go ahead and upload um, Evelyn's... I wanted to go ahead and upload Evelyn's box opening video so you guys wouldn't be like, Oh, who dat? And already know who it is. So um, that's actually being uploaded as I'm filming this, but this will be up later today as well. Um, so anyway, but you are getting one more, um, I have one more baby here that you haven't seen yet, so um, I'll show her to you in just a minute. I hate that the lighting is so bad on the, um, the crib here, but I've had to put all my silicone babies here. I used to have my Reborns up here and my silicones down on the loungers here. But for the reason of, one, my niece comes over more often and I'm terrified. She loves my doll, so I'm terrified of her going straight to the silicones. And at least up here, they're not as eye-catching. She usually goes for the ones down here and I can get to her in time to make sure she's careful. Um, and then also, my dog has never even attempted to hurt my dolls. But it's just one of those things that, like I taught her very early on, that they're off limits. And she's usually really good. Sometimes she'll kind of like lay between the loungers um, and all that. Sometimes she'll put her head on their, you know, their little legs or whatever. But, um, you know, it's one of those like it could just be a slip of her claw. Um, I don't want to risk my silicones getting injured, obviously. <laughs> so they're up here, but the lighting is really bad, which is, of course, the, the one bad thing. But I'm going to quickly show we've got Gabriel over here. Let me... See, I hate that the lighting's so bad, but there he is, and he's wearing um, this little red, white, and blue kind of dressy outfit. And then we've got Asher. Oh my gosh, the lighting. I'm trying to get out of the way. We have Asher, and um, he's wearing a little um, <laughs> Fourth of July top. We got an elephant dragging some balloons and some firecrackers. I know I got this at Walmart, so I think it's like Faded Glory or something like that. And just a pair of jeans here. We got Miss Evelyn, so I had a ton more, <laughs> more red, white, and blue boy outfits than I did girls. So technically, the romper she's wearing um, is for the boys, but you know what? Um, I threw a bow on her, and I think it's great, um, a great outfit for her. Still, um, you will notice something different about her. Um, she is at least matted. <laughs> she's not shiny anymore. But I have a video more on that later. But I did put her on a new body. She's been powdered and she's soft and sweet and um, there'll be more on that later but um, there she is looking real sweet I did take her hair out obviously I'm gonna get her rerouted in the near future then we get Rosanna in her little romper got her headband got her little socks um, I honestly oh hello camera string um, I think her romper is either mud pie or no, I'm pretty sure it's mud pie. Um, and then like her little headband and socks. I think they came from TJ Maxx. I'm not sure what brand they are, but looking sweet. Then we come down here, we get Miss Juliet. I think this outfit is Carter's and her little socks and headband came from the came from TJ Maxx as well. I gotta get her rooted too. She's on my list. Quite a few babies need to be rooted. We've got Justin here. He is wearing a uh, Magnolia baby set. Uh, with a little baseball dog wearing some red, white, and blue. Very cute. And we got Miss Flora. Flora is wearing a kissy kissy sleeper and it just it has like red and blue roses on it and it's white so it worked out <laughs> with her headband. Then we've got Caroline back here. She's also wearing one of the, one of the boys outfits but it works for her. She's got a, her hair bow looking cute. We got Sammy back here. I don't even know that I've ever actually introduced Sammy, so maybe you're getting an extra, extra, extra sneak peek. But this is, um, a little, my little mascot that I made. Um, the body I got from Trueborns. Uh, I know I've done a box opening of it, and then I decided to paint this little guy who was actually a boo-boo baby, 
Um, see, he has some paint missing that it would not stick in some areas because I had to strip it a couple times. Um, but he's still really cute, and so he's my he's my keeper as well. <laughs> I just threw a little red and white top on him. I love that he actually can wear Build-A-Bear clothing perfectly, like, because he's got a bear body, basically. A lamb one, but you know what I mean. Um, so I, <laughs> I have Build-A-Bear outfits that he wears. Um, and then we've got Miss Kendall. She is wearing, um, this little My Life brand from Walmart. They're little, like, 18-inch dolls. These clothes fit are pretty good. She's wearing a gamer shirt, but it's red, white, and blue with her jeans and her white sneakers. We got Mika. Mika here. I haven't shown her in a while. She's wearing her little, this top here. Oh, it's come unbuttoned. Oops. Um, this top here. Hold on, let me fix it. Well, I'll fix it later. <laughs> the top she's wearing, actually, um, she was wearing that when I bought her. Um, and then her headband and her socks and her little tutu was made by So S E W two the number two cute on Etsy, um, and it came with like another like little onesie. It almost looked like a Valentine set, but this works well. Then we got this little one that um, I promise I'm currently editing my IDTS um, trip videos, and she will be in there. She was one of my purchases that I made there. Um, she's really sweet. So more details about her in the next video, but she's just wearing, this is actually the outfit that I bought her in. She's wearing just a little red dress and hat, looking super cute. So they are all ready for the fourth. I managed to get them dressed a few days ago because I knew <laughs> it would sneak up on me and I wouldn't get them ready in time. So yay for finally achieving, oh, getting them ready and uploaded on the correct day that the holiday falls on. Wonderful. Um, anyway, guys, I guess that's it for this video. Hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your week and wonderful weekend. And uh, we will see you in the next video very soon. Bye-bye.